Hey, hello guys. I just want to talk about the problem going on in YouTube. That's the YouTube war. I'm getting tired of it. Can't we just have peace for once? You wish? Well, that's exactly what I wish as well. There can never be peace if somebody wants to hate each other. Every people want to hate each other as well. That is very, very uneasy to accept that peace cannot be here in YouTube. YouTube must never have war. This isn't what it has to be. War was never meant to be in that app or anywhere else. War isn't in going to solve anything. Just going to make things worse. Plus, plus you, you know what happened to bad weather in Zootopia? Well, after be hateful toward the predators, that leads to her downfall. She became very submissive once again, like the rest of her life. And now, I'm just going to, maybe soon, some of my favorite YouTubers are out of hatred for each other, will go have their downfall as well. Everyone has a downfall. No one ha is perfect in life. No one is perfect. The only one person who is perfect is God. It's not, life's never easy. These YouTubers think that riches and fame as well as anything that give pleasure to them would last forever. No, the only thing that would last forever in them is karma, their emotions as well as their soul. Their soul will last forever as well. Either you go to heaven or hell, hate is not worth it. It only led to your downfall. Come on, humanity, you better than this. Humanity cannot be like this. Could this could get any worse from this? I don't know, but this has to stop. Listen, everyone. Hate isn't worth it. To be, hmm. I experienced it once and it led to me. My face become like this because of like hmm, back then, and now it's a bit becoming a bit uglier. It became had the toll on my face. I have now have pimples because of that. The stress of becoming hateful. Now look, it have. Now look at my face. Because of that hate I experienced back in the past, now it left a very huge scar on my face. It's not only that, I become also very disrespectful as my mom back then, and life wasn't fun for me after that. So yeah. It isn't okay, guys. It isn't okay. Trust me. Hating someone like Jeremy the Bony fan isn't worth it. It. This is history starting all over again. It's like World War One and Two, except it's far more worse. This time we're hitting each other. This. This is what we want to do. This is how God created us. No. God didn't create us to hate. He created us to love each other, not to hate. Guys, come on. You, you can't do this to each other. Please, we can end this. Guys, I'm so very worried about you. I, I can't stand... Yeah, I'm being guilty.
please. I can't stand it. I can't stand the war. Please, it brings back to my days in the past. My friend is gone because of you. My mental state is also now breaking at this point. Uh, please, guys, stop. I don't want this to happen to any of us. I don't want this to happen. Look at my face now because of what happened like many years ago. All that hating back in my life, back in the past, is now becoming a toll at my face. Now, because of the stress of becoming hateful, I, it left a mark. Jeez, my face. I hate that. I hate my past life of hating. The stress. Please, guys, don't do this to each other. We humans are better than this. We can prove that we have feelings. How could we feel that? How how could we make the world a difference? How? How? We need to stop this madness. There are consequences of being hateful. There are consequences. There's never a good thing in being hateful towards each other. Never, ever a good day. War is just going to make things worse as well as hatred. War is just like Pandora's box, but much worse. It brings nothing but destruction in its wake. Don't you understand it? Don't you understand any of you? Don't you? This is what happens when, when people don't band together. In the view of God, we are nothing but... When we do this, we are nothing but the failures. We are nothing but failures. Look, even to him, even to him 15 years old, that doesn't mean I don't know anything. This is getting out of hand, guys. We can't keep doing like this. We need to change. Change is a necessity. I learned that. I changed my ways of being a hateful kid to a loving, kind person. You don't have to do this. But it, I respect that. It's your choice. Either you become a hateful, like me, person, back then, or the decision is yours. Please, just change. This is for the good of you. I love you guys. Please, make a change. This isn't fun anymore. This this isn't fun. Please. No, this isn't fun. Please. Please, guys, this, this really took us in it. My hateful past back then has made me be, look. Look at my face. Yeah. This, 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 this isn't very good. And please, guys, humanity is better than this. Remember, remember, please. We can't keep doing like this. We are never born to hate. We are born to love each other. Remember that. Please. Please, stop thinking of yourselves and stop thinking. Stop thinking about being famous. Start thinking about others. And stop thinking about anything bad. Like, if hating is a bad thing, then why not? Why nothing has any hating yet? Remember, hating can 
do things unpredictably bad. Bad things are unpredictable. They cannot be. They cannot be predicted by anything, at all. The only thing that predict them is God. He can do that. Guys, please, please change. I love you all, but this is for you good. Please, please, man. This isn't very good. Guys, please. I love you all. I love you, but this, this isn't who we are. Remember that. Oh my god. Open my eyes wide. Oh yeah, right, I'm Asian. Anyways, please guys. Please change. We can do this the easy way or the hard way. We can change and become a non-hateful person. Or we can be still like this. Which isn't good. Guys, the choice is yours, and goodbye. Peace.